What's up YouTube? This is Wes from Gray Bassin. Tonight we're in the bait cave. We're going to be doing some hand, hand pour swim baits. Uh, it's going to be a uh, color that I've been thinking about for uh, the last couple of weeks. Uh, never done it before. Uh, so I'm going to make sort of like a kokanee uh, color. Uh, it's going to be a uh, green pumpkin top with uh, some blue pearl in the middle and then some silver pearl on the bottom. Uh, we're going to be using uh, the Angling AI 4 and 5 inch slim baits tonight, the molds. Alright, follow along. All right, so we have the plastic heated up. I'm going to be putting in uh, some of the pearl. With these powders, a little bit goes a long way, so he doesn't add a lot at first. And if he needs more, he adds just a little bit at a time. So now he's adding just a little bit of the black flake. Uh, so as soon as this uh, gets back up to temp, I, I, I like to pour about 320, 330, somewhere in there. I have the uh, the molds heated up over there on the griddle already. Um, so that's just that's my temp that I like pouring at. Um, so as soon as this uh, gets back up to temp here, we'll uh, we'll take you over and I'll start pouring the, the bellies. And uh, I wanted to say uh, before here on the channel that um, we only use dead-on plastics here at the shop. I've used uh, a bunch of different plastics um, in the past, and uh, dead-on plastics is by far for me the uh, the best plastic.
All right, so we'll let those uh, sit for a second and then we'll heat up the, the middle vein and uh, pour that. All right, so now we're doing the, the vein color, which is uh, going to be a blue, blue pearl. It's a blue pearl brilliant from MF. Okay. All right, there goes the vein. That's nah, not... Uh, too much. So I can tell already that my blue vein is not even close to being dark enough. Not even close to being dark wood. So long, uh, this is so hot. It's not dark wood? No, not even close. And then we turn off the grill after this? After the top. That's three, that's five. So. For the top, we're going to do a, a green pumpkin color, and I want sort of a lighter green pumpkin than what I usually do. I think that's going to be about good. I want to try that. Dash of black flake. The dash of black flake. All right, so now that the uh, swim baits are cooled off, let's uh, let's open them up and give them a whirl. I don't think the middle vein is going to be dark enough for what I wanted, but we'll see. Let's start with the, the four inch. So everything is right where I expected it to be, except for the middle vein. You can barely see when you hold it up to a light at a different angle, you can barely see the blue vein. But everything else is right where I wanted it to be. 
I still like them. I think it's I think it looks pretty good. So I do a dark rainbow trout almost the same way except I darken up the the green pumpkin and then I have that red vein in there. And then I do the same bottom but so it's not quite what I was going for. All right. Now we'll see how these these five inches turn out. Of course, it's going to come out of the backside. Yeah, so you can see that blue a little bit better, but it's still still not obvious. probably barely see it if at all.